Hello everyone, Mikey here. I'm just gonna kinda go over the new weekly raid boss and how much of a pain in the ass he is. Um, if you don't already know. So, before I get started, I'll show you what my setup is. So, my outfit right now, I have my uh, skill perk up to 21. Actually, I'll just go back right here. Right here. I'll show you what my share is, too. So, in... I'm using the counterpoint, plus 33. Actually, I don't... Can I level it up? I don't know if I can. No, I don't. I can't. I don't have enough speed gems. What is it? I just want to see what it is. Oh, just that one goes up right there. Anyways, um... So, I just want to see. I, I couldn't remember if I could bubble it up or not. So, I'll show you what my setup is. So, I'm using the counterpoint plus 33 right now. Piglet, double cast, HD Ursula with uh, raids and strength. Uh, my KH2 Kari with second chance, two, an extra attack. Illustrated Terra with attack boost 3 Lux plus. Actually, I'm gonna level him up real quick before I start. Um, ground, he's only got ground defense and strength plus a thousand, so he's okay, but he's the best I got so far. And he's AoE. You need AoE with this boss, so. because the limbs are ridiculous. And then I got my Key Art 4 with a AB3 max Lux. And then I got Raid and Strength on him. I'm gonna level him up real quick, sorry. I forgot to do that. I don't know why he wasn't leveled up, I don't know. Maybe I just forgot about it. That'll help a little bit in damage. Okay. And then did I have Might as well do hers too. Did I have 20? I'm just gonna help a little bit stuff that I have right now that I'm using. Just never level them up, I don't know why. I have the mirrors to do it, I might as well. I forgot I had that many mirrors. Alright, there we go. No, I can do the most damage possible. And I'm gonna spawn real quick just to show you how much a pain in the ass this boss is. And I'm using, usually, uh, this 0.2 Aqua with AB2 Max Lux and Raids 40 and Aerial 60. It's pretty decent for these stupid limbs. Of course, not another one's better, so. I'll have to go into it again to spawn. Sorry, I just always check like that when I click like this. I'm just making my stream. My stream health is excellent because sometimes it it'll go out. Sometimes I don't know. I'm just paranoid about it for some reason. Whoops! Didn't mean to hit him. 
I'm sure not. Look at there's two of them here now. Go figure. Sorry, I thought I heard my daughter wake up, but it's not, she didn't wake up, okay. <sighs> Continuing, alright, anyways, so here it is, 99, submarine carp. I'll show you how much the limbs are a pain in the ass to kill on this thing. But, it does give you good experience, though. Look at that one, 351 and 99 in the limbs. Ridiculous. I'll show you how much damage, I'll, I'll just show you the whole thing, how much damage I can do then. This is why you need AoE medals. My key art for it's pretty good. I like this very cool. I have to turn off my auto so I can attack that one on the top. I have to rely on my second chance to even stun them twice, so... So if I had another uh, rating metal, I would do a little more damage, but fortunately I don't. So you still got 93. But second chance. I gotta turn off, I gotta stop out of it so I can make it hit that top one up there. And there you go, it's on the top one finally. 300 bars. Or 350 bars or whatever. Oh, I'm about to shed. Something like that. Too many. But then the base has so much life left after you stun them. Fortunately, you can only, I think, do half the body damage or so. He does almost a million damage though. Okay. He doesn't know any damage, I think that was more than I did. I'm gonna drop him down to 4.6. It's about as best I can do on this boss so far. I'm gonna get 6 million marks for that one with not on the right hour, so that's decent. So yeah. That guy's a pain in the ass. So yeah, I don't know. And then usually when I go in for the second attack, I go in with this one, because there's no more limbs to attack. Probably uh, 
stream my ra the raid over tonight. And I just hate relying on procs because like, two of my minerals in this setup don't have max, so I could do a, I could get a lot more looks if I had maxes on them. I have two more stuns on the, the boss, I then I could one shot it, but unfortunately I get three turns. I'm not gonna hit with Terra because he doesn't have max on, so. And I, I don't need them to finish this boss. And there you go, that's how you, how you defeat that thing. They take me two turns to kill him. But the, the limbs actually I think give you more lux than the base, so you want to kill the limbs first anyway. finger always hits on the side over here when I'm, I'm holding it, when I hold it sideways, you know? My finger always hits the side like this, and I, it slides up like that, that's why I keep doing that on accident. I'm gonna try a different way, actually, I'm not... I'm gonna let Second Chance hit me well and see what happens. I'm just gonna do auto. Let's see. Just see what I get. Because regardless, I have to go into the boss twice anyway. And my Second Chance procs almost every single time, so. using my Ursula on the top one. See what I bring it down to after this. 134. Yeah, I won't be able to finish that off if I without using uh, my Nova. I mean, if you use my Nova, you lose so much Lux. I have to go into this boss twice to kill it anyway, so. I don't know if it'll be able to take it out, let's see. Is it at 37? Yeah, I don't know, I don't know if it'll take it out. Nope.
Let's see, maybe hit it twice in my Ursa Will. Still get 5 million walks there. I won't need that other AoE now. Should be able to stun it with just those other two medals now. Actually, I will be able to. Yeah, I mean, just keep rolling and then you'll at least get in the top 100 if you have a decent red set up. You just have to have Lux Plus medals, or, yeah, Lux, yeah, Lux Plus medals. Max, Max isn't required, but if you have them, you'll, it'll, you'll get in the top 100 no matter what if you have all Lux Maxes. You get so much more Lux with the Lux Max. Yeah, I should be able to easily take out this guy now. Take it in, but oh, maybe actually. Let's see. No, oh, okay. sweet. Yeah, see the, the base doesn't give you as much looks. So if you're raiding in a group. Go for the the limbs first. If you get the limbs out of there, you'll get the most looks possible. I mean, obviously you want to attack all of it, kill, kill as much as you can. But if you can't kill the base, like like me, obviously I didn't kill the base in one turn. But if you can kill the limbs, those are where your most looks will be. So, yeah, I'm still 37th. And... Uh, someone else must be raiding, too. So... Let's see what the top 10 is right now. Yeah, let's see. He, this person at the top right now, is three times the amount of blocks I do. I don't have the time to do that. I mean, the top 10 is doable, but I, I don't have time to, it doesn't even matter, so if you go to rewards, only the top 5 matters, see, only the top 5. I just go for top 100, it's not even worth my time to even go for top 5. So then you get the, the charms, you still get the charms, you still get the, you know, Sids and the Chippendales. The only, the only difference is you don't you get an extra speed gem. It's not worth me spending all day and night writing. It's too much time and effort, but that's what I'm doing. I'm sticking in the top hundred, so I don't really raid that much. I only raid on uh, the raid hours, so that's how I'm 37th right now. I I only miss one raid hour a day, and that's usually in the morning. Because uh, it's 4 o'clock in the morning for me, and I'm not getting a better way to raid, so... But yeah, I don't know. That's what I'm doing for the raids on this week. But um, I'll put up another video, if not tonight, sometime this week, on uh, my raid hour. Alright, this is Mikey out. Peace.